Hey guys, it's Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm really sorry that yesterday I did not upload a video, but you have to understand I'm in college. It's finals week. It's cram time. I was literally working on a paper last night with my roommate for three hours. So um, yeah, that was why I did not upload. And I'm sorry for that. And I'm going to post every day um because then uh when i do have finals like today i a final i had my final for justice courts and legal system so it was not so long it only literally took me like 45 minutes so and then that's the only class i would have so up until i think when i leave college for the semester break um i will be posting every day and then i will vlog move out day um so yeah so i figured while i was home i just got home a couple like an hour ago or so um i'm going to hi baby sorry my dogs are here um i'm gonna do a what's in my vanity so as you all know i do have a caddy i did a what's in my caddy video a while ago so i figured that i just got a new vanity so why not do a what's in my vanity excuse me buddy so first i have the jeffree star lip for uh liquid frost this was also in my cavity but i kind of rearranged things around so this is in my vanity i have the shade frozen peach so you just like twist it up pump it and then it comes out of here which is kind of interesting i love the packaging then i have my Too faced hangover spray which i love to prime with and set it smells like coconuts which camera always falls so two faced hangover spray always love to set with this and hang with it i have a blush from steve laurent i don't think that's the same as yves saint laurent i don't know this blush is in rosé all day Yes, it's in rosé all day. I've mentioned this blush before, I think. It's just a really pinky tone blush. I have another blush. This is the Tarte Party Blush. It's the 12 Hour Amazonian Clay Blush. It's in the shade Party. So this one's more of a mauve pink, where the rosé one is more of a pink. This one's more of like a pink with a brown tone. This one's just more of a pink. I love blush, so like I really have like five blushes. Um, ColourPop Super Shock Shadow in Birthday Cake. Yeah, this is in the shade Birthday Cake. I love this. My sister used it once and used her fingers instead of a brush and kind of broke it. And I couldn't buy a new one because when I got this, when I ordered, I think I ordered lipstick or something. No, no, I ordered a palette. I ordered the I Love Serigi palette, Canon, and they gave me this free sh uh, shadow because it happened to be around my birthday, and they're only like for your birthday, so like, they're limited edition. So I have that. Um, then I have my Milani highlighter. Um, the one I ha I had this in my caddy, but I switched it out with the candlelight glow from Too Faced. So I have this one in my vanity. It's the strobe light instant glow in the shade 01 afterglow then i have a glitter liner from urban decay the heavy metal glitter liner in the shade midnight cowboy i have a m princess eyeshadow pigment and pretty petal I have that. That's the first drawer. The second drawer is all of my lipsticks. I'm sorry. I'm balancing you on a candle right now because I don't have anything else. So I'll start with this. This is from Dunkin' Donuts. It's strawberry flavored lip gloss. My mom got this for me last year for Christmas. It's just a stocking, so it's literally just lip gloss. And it looks like a donut. 
and I dropped the lid. I will pick that up later. I have my clear sonic face brush. This looks like that. I don't really use this that much anymore because I feel like it's a little too harsh for my skin. But when I do decide that I want to cleanse or exfoliate, then I will use this. Um, a lot of lip products coming up. So um, this is the Kylie Cosmetics Gloss in the shade Pop In. I think this was her first birthday collection that launched. It's literally just a gold lip gloss. So I like to put this on top of things. I like to use this as a topper more so than by itself. I have another Kylie Cosmetics lipstick. This is an, a matte liquid lip in the shade Dirty Peach, I think. Yes, Dirty Peach. I have the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquefied Matte Lipstick in the shade Me So Pretty. I put this on in my candy cane makeup tutorial. Um, my Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in the shade Pioneer, which is a super pretty matte red. I use this in my holiday tutorial. I have some more Too Faced lip products. I love Too Faced lip products. I have the Melted Matte Mini in the shade Drop Dead Red. It's like a really pretty like dark chocolatey red. Um, I have Melted Latex which is like a lip gloss in the shade Hopeless Romantic, I think. Yes, Hopeless Romantic. I have a Melted Chocolate in the shade Chocolate Honey. You kind of just squeeze it like that and then just put it on, which is kind of cool. Um, then I have just a Melted in the shade Chihuahua, which is funny because I have a Chihuahua. I think that's why I was... This is a liquefied lipstick. So these are both liquefied lipsticks. They're not matte. They're more of a velvet or satin formula. I have a NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Paris. This came in one of those palettes because NYX has um, these palettes. And, like There's like eyeshadows and then you get a lip gloss. This is a lip gloss. I gave my sister the palette. It's just like a pink. I don't really wear this except like when I'm doing fun looks or holidays like like Halloween. I have this is from Bonita. It's a matte lip cream. It doesn't really have a sh yeah. There's no shade. It's just like a neon pink. Again, I have an assortment of colors. Um, uh, this is another one from Bonita. I think this is more of a dark pink. Yeah. And then. Because what bothers me about these is I got them in a set. Where's the other one? No, that's not. I think I gave my sister the other one. But these came in a set of like two or three. And the packages, like the packaging, don't match the lipstick. Like the packaging looks red, and I love red, so that's why I got them. But they're more pink than red. So. Um... I have a City Color Collection Lip Cream in the shade, does it have a shade? It says lip gloss. Is it in the shade lip gloss? I'm a little confused. I don't know. I'm uncertain of this one. I think I got that in the collection. Yeah, this is the City Colors Collection Matte Lipstick. So, like, this is the lipstick. That was the gloss, I guess. Yeah, it's literally in the shade, like, lipstick. Lip gloss. A little strange. And then I have a MAC. Lip glass. This was the collection that they did with Ariana Grande. And it's called Viva Glam Ariana Grande. It's just like a little like a clear pinky gloss. Then you can wear it by itself or on top. I have another Kylie 
not liquid lip. This is in the shade Malibu. I think this was my first liquid lip. And then she had a sale, and I got, when I bought the blush, the Bailey Legal blush I have, I got the Dirty Peach one for free. I think that's what the sale is. You got like a free lipstick of your choice when you bought like a blush or a highlighter or a bronzer. I have a blue lip, uh, I have a blue lipstick because I was stitched one year for Halloween. So I got a blue lipstick. This is just from Party City. It's literally just blue. That's it. Then I have, this is from, I think this is from Bite Beauty. If I'm right. Um, it's in, yeah, it's Bite Beauty in the shade Glace. I think this is a lip liner or it's a lipstick. Not really sure. Got this as one of those samples from Sephora for your birthday. So I have a Bite Beauty lip balm. I have a Bite Beauty lipstick in the shade Chai. So I think this is the lipstick and the, the glazed one is the lip liner. Yeah. And then I have a bunch of lip liners. This one is from Kylie Cosmetics. This is the Dirty Peach one, right? Yes, this is the Dirty Peach liner. So it's just the same as the lipstick. I just need to sharpen these. I have a Revlon Color Stay Liquid Eye Pen. This is just an eyeliner. I have a Clinique Pretty Easy Liquid Eyelining Pen. The shade 01 Black is Black. Then I have another Kylie liner from Malibu. Because the lip kits, you get the lipstick and the matching lip liner. And then I have a Lib Lauritzi Cosmetics Lipstick in the shade Plum. But this is like a weird kind of lipstick. This is more like a liner lipstick. I don't know if I'd ever use this as like a lipstick. It kind of reminds me more of a lip liner. So I have that. I have a brow slash eye one. I use these. These are like 99 cents from I think Wet n Wild or something. Yeah, Wet n Wild. They're cool eyeliner pens, but I use them for my eyebrows when I do my eyebrows. This is just, I think, in Coco. I have uh, the L'Oreal Paris Exclusive Collection Blake's Red. So it's just like a really pretty red. When I was in Color Guard, they made us buy all these lipsticks for makeup. We also bought like palettes and stuff, like little ones, like from L'Oreal or like Wet n Wild or whatever. But I give this to my mom. I have a Jeffree Star Lip Ammo in the shade Celebrity Skin. It's a really pretty nude. I think it's similar to the Patrick Star um, Mama Star nude, but this one's a little more taupey. I have the Elf. I think this is a... Uh, T Rose. I think this is a lip. This is either a lipstick or a lip liner. Not really sure. It doesn't really say. I have a NARS lip liner in the shade Corella. I love putting this under any red. So, like this one, these go really well together. The Blake's red from L'Oreal. I got this for my birthday from Sephora. It's just like a red lip liner in the shade Corella, and I love that because you know Corella Deville, Disney. I am obsessed with Disney. Um, then I have the NYX Liquid Lip Suede in the shade Sway. Yes, it's just purple. I solely bought this for my Iron Grande tutorial. For my Iron Grande, God is a Woman. I seen. I think it was Adeline Morin. I love Adeline Warren. I always talk about it. Um, I think she used this in her tutorial. That's why I used it. And then I have the Rimmel London Kate Moss 107. This is my favorite red. Yeah. Rimmel London X Kate Moss 107. It's my favorite red. I got this also for Color Guide, but I know this is one of Zoella's favorite um, lipsticks for the holiday season. So that's kind of funny. I love Zoella. I love her Vlogmas. 
And then I think this is an e.l.f. Yeah, this is an e.l.f. lipstick in the shade Ravishing Rose. It's really pretty rosy pink. So I have a selection of mattes, reds, liquids, velvets, all that jazz. And then for the heck of it, I have a scrunchie in my drawer. And then in the bottom drawer, I have some of my larger palettes. I have the Tartlet Tees palette, which was kind of a ripoff because it was $20 and you only get six shades. I don't know why I did that, but I got six shades for $20, which I felt was kind of a ripoff because this Morphe palette has 15 shades and only cost me $15. So it was literally a dollar per shade. And this is the Morphe 15 inch Happy Hour palette. I love this palette. It's one of my go-to warm palettes. And I have an e.l.f. palette. Shade uh, Nude Rose Gold. News, nude Rose Gold. This is the one that I struggle to open every single time I use it. So like I never use it because like I can't fucking open it. Um, but it's just a nude palette. That's really it. And then there's like two rose gold shades. That's it. I have a Tarte Customizable Z palette. But, which is funny, the shades are actually Morphe. So, I'm not going to say the names of the shadows, but I guess you can like Google them. I think this one's called Fairy Tale. I'm pretty sure this purple one's called Fairy Tale. I think the yellow one is Honey. I'm pretty sure. And I think this one's called Glow Baby or Glow Mama or something about glowing. I'm not. And I dropped a lipstick. So that's my like Z palette, Tarte X Morphe. I just created it. I guess. So then I have a Anastasia Beverly Hills Moonchild Glow Kit. This is the colors. It's blue ice, star, purple horseshoe, pink heart, lucky star, lucky clover actually, and blue moon. Just a whole ray. I like to use the blues for when I do like icy looks. But then I love to mix the pink heart with blue ice because I love that dual chrome look. And sometimes I'm feeling it, I'll tap in lucky clover to get that more of a greenish duo chrome. And then I'll swatch uh, Pink Heart. So that's Pink Heart and Blue Ice. That's Blue Ice. Sorry, I swatched it a little weirdly. So, and I fucking dropped it. Great. It didn't crack or anything, but yeah. I got my sister the, uh, I think it's the Aurora Borealis or just Aurora palette because I got them from back uh, for Black Friday, I think, last year. And it was like four, it was like $20 each. So I spent 40 on two of them instead of 40 for just one. So that was a good deal. And then I have my Laura Lee Cat's Pajamas palette, which I did a whole video on. I did um, a video where I used this to create a full face of makeup. So, go watch that. It's on my channel. Um, I have a Too Faced. I have way more makeup at home. Makeup bag. I just use this as my travel bag. So, there's a couple of things in there. So, I'll just open that up. It's just a spare toothbrush. A spare lipstick. It's a French vanilla lipstick from... Chapstick. Lip balm from Dunkin' Donuts. I have a spare deodorant. A uh, toothbrush. Uh hand cream, toothpaste, and a perfume, just in case I decide to spend the night at someone's house, or I just go on vacation, I have this all in here, these are all spare products, don't think like, these are really the only things I have, and they're just sitting in my drawer, so, um, I have the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Press Powder, the shade 823C Neutral Beige. My friend Jules gave this to me. Unfortunately, I shattered it. But I still like to use it sometimes when I'm really careful with it. 
then I have three elf pots. So they're elf duos. This one is in the shade Happy Hour Rose. So it's a transition shade and then a lid color. So it's a brown and then a gold with this one. This one is in the shade 9 to 5 Nudes. So it's just a matte white, I think, and then a brown. And then this one is Hot Date Dinner. And it's a black and a dark brown uh, shimmer. So like you can use this for like a smoky eye if you wanted. These kind of remind me of the ones um, from Smashbox. The ones that are supposed to look like a camera. Uh, my aunt gave me these. Christmas they all came in like a package and then my sister got some so yeah and that's my entire vanity so thank you so much for watching this video I really hope you enjoyed uh, like comment subscribe you know the drill always remember be a pineapple wear crown stay be a pineapple stand tall wear crown you see on the inside bye guys